It should be a spicy dinner conversation when Queensland's Premier joins other state leaders at dinner at the Lodge tonight before tomorrow's COAG meeting. The Premiers are mainly opposed to the Prime Minister's income tax sharing plan. Malcolm Turnbull says it would ensure the states are more responsible in their spending as he announced a new plan to treat chronically ill patients. In the consultation room, consulting on a new primary health care plan. To manage your care in a holistic way. Looking to minimise unnecessary hospital admissions through tighter case management of chronically ill patients by their GP. It is one of the most significant reforms in the history of our health care system. But not as significant as his plan to give states income taxing powers and with it full accountability for hospital and public school spending. This is about better government, better services greater responsibility, stronger democracy. And something he'll put to the Premiers at dinner at the Lodge tonight and their formal meetings tomorrow. We are a long way from having a position of being able to say yeah, yay or nay. The Labor Premiers are already saying nay. We're going in there and I look forward to the lecture from Malcolm Turnbull tomorrow. Some of the money they're talking about putting on the table just is inadequate. Seven News understands Malcolm Turnbull will offer the Premiers just under $3 billion tomorrow to bridge the hospital funding gap to 2020 and seek agreement to keep talking about his income tax idea. Double taxation is Mr Turnbull's idea of reform. Mr Turnbull's idea is for the Commonwealth to lower income tax rates by 2% and for that amount to then be levied by the states. That would not be double taxation. So that's the credibility that Malcolm Turnbull brings to the table tomorrow. One big April Fool's joke. The Prime Minister insists the days of the Premier's coming to Canberra cap in hand and treating the Commonwealth like an ATM are over. Spending other people's money, it's human nature, you're rarely going to be as careful about it as you should be. Something for them to chew over at dinner tonight. Mark Riley, 7 News.